Oh, it's still the morning. Good morning, everybody. Reason I'm just going back and, and looking at Saturday, the scrimmage work you guys did. What did you take away from that? Uh, I see guys are really excited to be back out there. Defense is, you know, a lot more physical than what they were. Because I, I heard from what they're telling us, you know, they're simplifying the defense, just letting them kind of go play. Uh, we really focused on situation. It was really a thinking, a thinking man's game Saturday. So it was it was tough because we kept having to make sure we knew what down the distance it was, what situation we was in, personnel-wise. You know, what we were kind of going for as far as conversions and kind of the situation and what we were dealing with. When it comes to the run game, where do you feel like you guys are in terms of gelling together right now? I feel we, we still gelling well, but you know, as far as learning the new the new steps, the terminology, kind of the blocking scheme of it, you know, we may be just a little bit behind, but at the end of the day, we running hard. We we coming in, seeing film, staying with the old linemen, listening to what they got to tell us. And I mean, they set up good periods where we do kind of come together and we talk and kind of walk through things at a very slow pace, so we can't understand it and see where our fits is, where we're supposed to be at, what we're supposed to expect from them, so we can kind of play off each other. How much of an adjustment has there been for running backs? Is there a big difference in what you're doing now in this game compared to last year? A little bit. We're doing a, you know, a lot of things from the gun. Uh, you know, last year it was a lot of downhill type of you know, uh, running with a fullback. But you know, this year it's kind of long. This is held back in the, uh, in the gun with uh, Worley and, and uh, Peterman. But I like it. I mean, it's different. It's giving us a different kind of feel. I hear we're still going to you know, get back to the downhill running. So. I mean, it's fun. I'm having fun. I think everybody's enjoying it, so it's not too bad. How different is it running without a fullback? I feel you have to press more, if that makes sense to anybody. Pressing a little bit. We kind of have to take our defender to the block versus our fullback and kind of go dig them out. But I feel we got to be a little more crisp and detailed in how we run the ball now. I say it's still pretty physical. Coach get after it, you know, pretty quick. I want to say as soon as we got out here, we won a team period. So he likes the physicality, and that's something he big on. So we, we get with it real fast. Rajon is a, a guy who played some wide receiver in college. Do you think this offense will kind of utilize those skills you have out of the backfield of catching the ball as well? I think so, but I'm not going to lie. I do not want to be a receiver. <laughs> as much as running as they're doing and the stuff they being asked to do, man, all I can do is, you know, pray for them, wish them luck, because they got a big task on their hands. How much of an adjustment do you think this has been for your old lineup there? I know you work out with those guys. You know those guys really well. And it seems like the especially with a lot of the zone stuff in the running game, it's kind of an adjustment for them. I feel it's an adjustment, but I don't think it's a big one. I mean, when I got here in my freshman year, we ran outside zone, inside zone. I think the biggest difference, I would say, is the old linemen in their training. They're, you know, they've been asked to kind of, you know, shed a little bit of weight, kind of dial back on what they're eating. They're actually paying attention a little bit more on, you know, what they're eating, how they're training, because everything we're doing is, you know, fast pace, so we want those guys to be able to roll. How close were we all to getting the orange shirts back today? I think we were pretty close. I'm not going to lie. Close. Yeah, I think the team period, we uh, we, 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 we went toe-to-toe -to -toe on the team period. But, you know, the defense ended up pulling it out a little bit. During, during that drill where they had the linebackers and the running backs hitting, I think that Fugit was a guy who was hitting a lot harder than he was last year. It seemed like he's more comfortable over there. Did you notice a couple of thuds he was laying out there? It looked a little different than last year. I feel Fugat has always been one of those guys that just, he really loved the game. So whatever you ask him to do, he pretty much going to give you everything he got to go do it. But, you know, I feel with simplifying the defense for those guys and kind of telling them, you know, just go out there and play, give us effort, and we'll correct the other things, I think those guys are playing a little bit more free now. Who would you get matched up with in that drill? I had Sap. How'd that go? I didn't shake him, but I got around him and tiptoed the sideline, so I think it counted as a point for the offense. But I didn't get tackled. 